Okay, Oval fans, you just saw the promo for next week's episode, Season 5, Episode 7, entitled Exit Wound. Hunter makes accusations about fidelity that could turn the district upside down. Basically, he is questioning the trust or reliability or the loyalty of those around him due to his overdose. Kareem is taken from the hospital against his will to face Hunter once and for all. Yeah, folks, Kareem is probably going to end up dead. Seriously. Um, I honestly see no way for him to get out of this one. We do see a blink any moment, um, blink and you miss it moment from the promo where some guard is like, you know, hitting Kareem upside the head and he's screaming like, you know, he's being taken against his will. So that's going to happen. Um, because in the promo Hunter's like, you bring that little punk to me, Donald, uh, Donald and Kyle, like, wait, what? He must know something about the drugs considering, you know, it came from his pharmacy. So yeah, Kareem is probably done for. And before this happens, we know Dale gives him a phone call. Remember, Dale is going to be uh, tucked away in Alan's apartment for a while. He's telling Kareem that he quit. And he's like, yeah, because I didn't know you had this whole illegal drug operation thing going on. So, yep, he's out an employee now. Um, oh yeah, plus Sharon's in jail. There ain't no telling when that pharmacy is going to be reopened. Too bad for all those people in the neighborhood that get their prescriptions from uh, Kareem's pharmacy. Tisk tisk tisk. Um, I I'm I'm guessing Alonzo's really dead. I honestly, because he wasn't referenced or seen in the promo at all, we do see a moment where Priscilla and Richard seem to be coming into the residency, you know, with uh, a tray with you know food and whatnot for the president. So I'm pretty sure Alonzo's going to be cleaned up before they get up there. Um. Hunter is yet again in his paranoia says like everyone involved in this gone. I, I think this is referencing like anyone attached to the whole drug situation. He wants them dead. Hunter is really pissed off because of his kidney failure. I believe it was stated in this week's episode like, hey, you know, with your kidneys in the uh, situation, they are like the doctor can't give you anything. You can't get, you know, use coke or anything because that will pretty much kill you well i'm the president that don't hey but you're also human that's the that's the main reason he's pissed off about all this um so speaking of uh going back to dale we do have alan uh talking with a uh, desiree and the other dude basically they're explaining to him that hey we're with the fbi uh we know there's a lot of crazy stuff going on in the white house with this uh you know hunter franklin and the fact that you work there, you know a lot of stuff. So basically, we need your help. Basically, you know, the same, same, the same old, same old. You help us bring down the president and we'll help you out of your situation. I mean, come on. How many times have we gone through this in the show? Then I guess the final thing to talk about here, Eli in the bunker with Simone. Basically, hey, uh, you know, the first lady, she wants to press charges. You know, she's brought up charges against you. And someone's like, yeah, I know she wants to do that, Eli. Well, hey, I talked her out of it. So did you talk her out of it or did you fuck her out of it? <laughs> and from there, Eli's like, hey, calm down. You need, we need to keep our eyes on the prize. So uh, I guess Simone might be getting out of the bunker in this next episode, but we'll just have to wait and see. Reminder, the title is called Exit Wound. So keep in mind, Alonzo got shot up and Kareem, well, he might be going to the other side soon himself. So with that being said, that is the trailer for the next episode. Let me know your thoughts in the comments, like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.